Hey everybody, how are you? This is this is Lenny Applequist from Free Market Media Group, and I'm throwing this video up real quick today because a lot of people are hosting it in motion. Hosting have been hacked, and it's like, what do you do? How do you recover from this? Well, good news and bad news. Good news is in motion's working their butt off to restore everything, and they're doing a good job. However, problem is, is they're going through a process. Well, let's back up a second. So, what the hack actually is today? It's what they call a defacement hack. And I'll show you what it looks like in a second. But all that happens is the hackers get in and this, the software that they're running looks for files that are called index and it removes those and it adds their own index.php file, which um, is encrypted. I looked at it, couldn't make heads or tails of it. And it calls in the information for the site and I'll show you in a second. Because they're quite clever, these hackers, um, and extremely annoying and that's really all it is. So don't panic, it's just a really big annoyance um, especially if you've done custom work on your index page, um, on that page. So um, I'm going to show you how to restore, uh, how to fix that. But now here's the problem. Like I said, InMotion is actually doing a really good job fixing uh, your main page. But what the problem is, is that they're not only replacing the main page. Um, InMotion uses cPanel as their admin panel for your hosting. And so that uses a file structure where the root of your site is public underscore HTML. If you have no idea what I'm talking about here, you really need to go get a professional legal fix this for you. Um, but if you have some vague understanding, this is going to help you a lot. So the problem is, is InMotion's um, going through and they're removing the hacked page and they're, um, and they're restoring a page that existed some hours ago, but only in the root. And this hack is actually affecting every folder in that root area. I'm going to show you what I mean in a minute, but that means it, for every root folder, every folder that's in your public underscore HTML, there's a brand new index.php file in there. And my concern with this is, is that there's information in there that will allow the hackers back in at some future date. And so we, you've got to go through and clean all those up. I mean, that's what we're doing today. We have over a hundred sites on our server. Um, and so we're doing a lot of cleanup today, but I want to do this to help. So let's, um, let's take a look at their, uh, um, these fancy hackers work here. Okay, so there it goes. Way tricky. Look at that animation floating around. Yeah, server hacked by TigerMate. Um, so we don't know if they're really a Bangladeshi hacker. Um, I really don't care. But um, let me just show you something. So um, this is the index file on the home page. It was basically the home page. Uh, so what you want to do is use some kind of FTP program. I'm on a Mac. I use Fetch. On the Mac, you can use CyberDuck or FileZilla. On the PC, uh, you can use Qt FTP, and there's a number of other FTP programs. You need to connect your hosting because we need to replace this page. And um, with a lot of WordPress installs, it can be a little different. So I'm going to show you mine in particular, um, how you need to actually really fix it. So here we are, free market design. I've already opened it up. And if you look, um, this index page was updated on the 25th of September today, but here is the kicker, is all of these folders, the subfolders, all have been updated today. Um, and if you look deeper, because I've already looked, um, for instance, in this folder, demo, look at that, there is another file. So you have to go through and really look for every index.php file um, because they've been replaced, I'm guaranteeing you. And um, in the instance where you see the date as today on these folders, that probably means that there was no index.php file in there um, to begin with. So that's why the folder showing the update. Um, you know, like if we go into my art folder, that's where all my graphics images are. There shouldn't be that. So you just want to delete them. So I, in fetch, right click, delete it, say yes, delete permanently. You've got to get rid of all of those. So now let's go back anyway and fix this. So what we want to do is you want to make sure you have a current copy of WordPress downloaded on your computer. And so um, we're going to go here to where I have it. Um, so we're going to go to the current one, 3.2.1. You see that index.php matches this one over here. So depending on what your format is, on a Mac I can drag and drop. I think you can on a PC. Um, you just want to overwrite that. But now here's the catch. Um, on this WordPress install, my WordPress actually lives in this folder called Los Angeles Web Design. So if you have a setup like this, here's what's going to happen. I've just now replaced this hacked page here. 
So when I refresh, you're not going to see this, but here's what you're going to see instead. It's a broken page to WordPress because WordPress is now looking for WordPress is now looking for um, it's looking this page is looking for where WordPress is installed. Like I said, it's in Los Angeles web design. So what we need to do is uh, I will just do it by hand. So what we need to do is you need to open up. You need to now edit and you can do this before you upload, but you need to edit this index.php file. Um, you'll see here it's saying loads WordPress environment and template. Uh, it sounds kind of Greek, but what it's saying is it's looking right here in the same folder for that. So if you have WordPress installed in the same place that index.php is, you're fine. But if you have it in a in a subfolder, you need to fix it. So what you're going to do is put the back the slash forward slash whatever that one is, um, and mine is web design loss. Angeles and obviously SEO reasons there and then if we save it uh, if we save if we save it and now refresh this oh sorry it's Los Angeles web design not the other way around um, Sorry, I would actually be redoing this video if I wasn't in a hurry to get it out to you guys because I'd want to do something to help because this sucks, to put it very bluntly. So now we're going to go back to Firefox and refresh. And there we go. So now, now we're um, back up here, but now check it out. If I actually go to the blog itself, which is inside that Los Angeles web design folder, look, I'm still got the little hackers going. So you need to go into that um, subfolder, which is here on my server, and you gotta you gotta upload your WordPress file to replace that one also. So let's replace that one. Now let's refresh here. And now we're back. Alright, so now we're back. But now here's the real important part. You really need to go, let's go back to the public underscore HTML. You have to go into all, all of these folders and delete that index.php. Anyone that was uploaded today, you have to get rid of it. And if it was, no, I don't want to edit it. Um, do not want to edit it, I just want to delete it. Um, you need to delete it. Uh, every single one, so you need to go through every folder. And this is the most important part. So I hope that helped. If you have any questions at all, um, what you can do is you can go to um, my, our WordPress, our uh, Facebook page, which is facebook.com slash free market media group. Ask your questions here. I'll be looking at this all day and I will answer them if you need help. Uh, we can either do it or we can point you in the right direction where you can get help. Uh, the fix will really only take, you know, a half hour at the top. Um, so, so do that, but I would really like to help people out because this, this sucks and it's happened to me before and it happens to big sites all the time, but, but when we're small businesses, we don't always have the resources to just get on top of this. So um, whatever we can do, um, we would be very, very happy to assist. So um, that's it. Good luck with this and let us know if you need anything else. All right. Have, have a great Sunday. Bye-bye.